Hi everyone, welcome to Straight from the Divine Tarot. I'm doing another read for you guys. Today it is Saturday, October 8th, 2022. And here up, up here in Canada, we have Thanksgiving this weekend. So happy Thanksgiving, everyone. My fellow Canucks, hope you guys enjoy your weekends. Each and every one of you is out there. Canuck or, Canuck or not. <laughs> um, okay, I'm going to do another read. Um, just finished one. I haven't uploaded it yet, though. Okay. So, as you guys know, I don't use the signs. I don't use the genders. And it's a timeless read. Okay. Um, so, I'm not going to skip this, this spiel. Let's get on with the read, shall we? Um, please like, share, and subscribe. Hit the notification bell if you wouldn't mind. And join this channel. I, that would make me eternally grateful. I'd be so very happy. Thank you for helping me grow this channel. It means the world to me. I love each and every one of you. Yes. Okay. So let's start the read. How are we getting the read? Thank you, the Swan Queen. Transformation, intuition, patience, card number 13. So that's death in the uh, in tarot. So there's a change here. There's a, a death and rebirth. Somebody could be icy cold right now, but uh, maybe they have reason, reason to, because there's a swan there. Swans are, uh, there's two swans, sorry. They're monogamous here. Somebody could have gotten in between you and another swan, let's say, okay? So there's transformation, something's changing here, okay? You've got great intuition and a lot of patience. It also adds up to a four, one and three, so that's the emperor, so we bossed up, taking, took back their power, possibly. Let's see where this goes. The so swan queen card number 13, spirit guides, guardian angels, ancestors, white light. Please clarify, the swan queen for the collective for today, please. Thank you, that's too much, too much, too much. Swan queen, why is she here, please? Card number 13. Our father, Swan Queen, please. Okay. We have abundance. Keep a positive mindset. Manifest exactly what you want. Gratitude and bliss. It's beautiful. Transformation, yeah. Intuition, patience. Yeah, you've waited here. Maybe maybe you're online reading, reading cards and you're going to be doing very, very well. Bottom of the deck, girl talk. Time with friends. Moving on. Happily single. Living in the moment and having fun. Good for you. I mean, it doesn't have to be just girl talk. I mean, it could be males. It doesn't matter. There's no gender here, right? It's all energy. Swan Queen, card number 13 in abundance. We get one more to clarify, please. Spirit guides, guardian angels, ancestors, white light. Swan Queen, card number 13, abundance. Thank you. You're bossing up, I think. Atonement, card number 31. It adds to a four again. So maybe there's a, a an emperor wanting atonement. They stuck knives in your back, big time. Look, 10, 11. I believe this one's 11's um, knives. They they really did you wrong here. Somebody wants forgiveness, possibly. Hmm. Let's see where this goes. Spirit guides, guardian angels, ancestors of white light. What is the message here for the collective for today? Swan Queen, card number 13. 1331, by the way. Look that number up, okay? And we have Atonement, card number 31, and Abundance. Why is this here, please, good guys? Guardian Angels, Ancestors, White Light. There's an apology coming here, possibly. Page of Cups in the upright, and it just flew out. You are innocent. You're sweet. Um, could be a budding new ro romance beginning here with an actual emperor, a true emperor. Not a phony. This is here, please, for guides. Guardian angels, ancestors, white light. Thank you, spirit. First card up. Magician in reverse. There's been illusions, deception. Somebody had two faces here. A lot of manipulation, trickery, sleight of hand. Um, this could be corruption, being very chaotic, un unable to focus here. Could fe be feeling powerless. Something's not a go. Something's not victorious here, okay? Um, Ten of Swords in reverse. Could be a near-death experience. Could be magic as well, okay? Magic that went wrong. I just did a read about magic, but this could also be wanting forgiveness. Ten of Swords in reverse. Wanting to, you know, end a situation here. This ending of a situation. It's time to recover, recoup, regroup. Yeah, somebody's got victory here. Success. They could be out the public eye. Um, this is recognition and reward. 
Somebody's out in the public eye. It's beautiful. It could be you, it could be them, I don't know. This uh, The Six of Wands typically is a wounded warrior. Um, winning in battle, coming home to the accolades of their community. Okay? There are people watching here. Six of Wands in the upright. Why is, yeah, King of Swords. Oh my God. Again, this is a narcissist. Could potentially be a narcissist, okay? Uh, take it as it applies, okay? But this is a pathological liar. Something that lies. They use and abuse. They're cold, calculated, and cruel. Very abusive. Self-serving. Very cold, right? They lied about a partnership or a, or a relationship or lied to a soulmate or about a soulmate. I don't know. They're married. Wow. So somebody was caught out in public <laughs> with their... With their uh, flavor of the night or, or month or whatever. I don't know. King of Swords in reverse. The liar or whatever this is. Male or female. It doesn't matter. Okay. Yeah. This is a lot of pressure here. Somebody's under a lot of... They have burdens here. So somebody had a point to prove. A chip on the shoulder. They committed themselves to a situation or to a lie. And now they're buckling underneath the weight of these, these burdens. Um are unable to keep carrying these burdens around but because they committed themselves to this lie it would look funny if they did put them down right so <laughs> they're caught between a rock and a hard place yeah there's been delays there's uh, no passion here no new beginnings they can't take any action or maybe they got an std pretending everything's fine yeah look at me i'm fine no no not everything is fine Ten of Wands. Why is the Ten of Wands in the upright? Yeah. So they committed themselves to a Queen of Cups in reverse. Something that's very emotionally manipulative, right? They use emotions to get their way. Um, the funny thing is, is they can't control their emotions. Um, they, they, they cry for no reason. They scream and shout, have hissy fits. They're very emotionally, they use blackmail emotion, emotional blackmail to get what they want. Um, they're very superficial, surface level, selfish, could be a big, big drinker here, a bad mother, whoever this is, male or female, um, they really don't care who they hurt, okay? They committed themselves to this person. Mm, there's a lot of lies and illusions. They want your forgiveness. I think they, this person came in between you guys, possibly. Ooh, a few of them came in between. This could be two people, could be one. I don't know. Take it as it applies, but this is a Queen of Pentacles that's very greedy and selfish, uh, materialistic, codependent, clingy. Uh, it's not that they can't work, it's they don't want to. They're lazy. It's a lazy card. They're very jealous. They don't know their value or worth. They have no integrity, loyalty, or honesty. Damn. <laughs> They're very unfaithful. Not to be trusted. Very unstable. Yeah, Seven of Pentacles beneath that. This is a poor investment. Wow. Very poor investment. It's time to move on here, okay? This is not going anywhere. Somebody's not putting any effort into a situation. Maybe they're out of money here. It's time to move on. It's time to relocate, possibly. It's a card if you get what you give. A breakup of a family or a group. Somebody got scapegoated. They're not happy. There's no emotional fulfillment or happiness. I just heard somebody wanted their own personal harem. Are you kidding me? Yeah, and flaunted it out in front of their friends. Look at me, I've got all these bitches. Okay. This is somebody with a very, very small ego. I mean, very large ego, but um, very fragile ego. Yeah, Empress in reverse. Holy crap. Three women. Are you kidding me? These people are very chaotic, okay? Um, Self-absorbed. Um, very promiscuous. I heard he wanted to be a pimp. You fucking kidding me? They got caught. They're coming clean. Okay? Somebody's very self-absorbed, chaotic. They don't bring new life into the world. They, they destroy life. They're very um, superficial people. There's no genuineness about these people. It's all surface level. What they can get is all dirt. It's just dirt. Yeah. Somebody's going through a, bad, um, a really bad... Uh, about a depression here. Um, they're going through a dark night of the soul. They're not happy. They're in a dark place. This is not wish fulfillment. Definitely not. They, they all have addictions. Everybody wants to be in the limelight. Um, this is not satisfaction. It's not achievement here. 
They lied to themselves, I think, right? It's all based on ego. So somebody's coming clean about this, seven swords in reverse. Yeah, they lied. Sabotage here. They target people, maybe. Page of swords in reverse. This is news you don't want to hear sometimes, right? They lied. They spread rumor, gossip, and slander. This is sabotage, self-sabotage here. Somebody's petty and cruel. They're bullies. They, they, I think all of them are bullies. They, they bully other people. I don't know. Online, maybe. They bully people. They, they target people with money. I just, okay, I get it. They're going to jail, okay? They target people that are uh, successful, stable, and secure, that have money. I get it. It's 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 a, one of those scam scam rings, romance scammers rings, right? But he's the I guess this male is the head of this, and the females do the work, right? Or vice versa, it could be a whole bunch of people, male or female, doesn't matter. Yeah, yeah, he's the head of it. Yeah, Bernie upright. Look at me, look at me. I'm so important. Mm-hmm. Yeah. There's awareness here. People are aware of what's going on, wanting to move forward with something. What is this? Temp Emperor in the upright. They think they're God's gift. Nine of Cups in the upright. They're quite satisfied, you know, with themselves, always wanting the attention. They got all this attention, right? But is it is it good attention? I don't know, because the truth is coming out. The Hermit reverse. They're unstable. They're not happy. There's a lot of jealousy going on here, okay? Nine of Pentacles, just maybe they're struggling financially here. It's not working out. They thought maybe with all the thieving they were doing, you know, targeting of people, romance scammers, this is all, this is corruption, this is instability, this is laziness and jealousy, abuse of power, abuse of authority, greedy, um, materialistic, all they care about is money and their image, you know, yeah. Somebody wants to let go of this lifestyle maybe. They want to remove these, 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 um, these burdens, uh, removing um there's i guess i was looking for a word i can't remember what it is now they want to remove the obstacles here there's obstacles in their way they could be financially unstable right now or just mentally unstable i don't know physically unstable they want to let go of something or someone they want to let go of this this lifestyle giving their couple love to to people right somebody's found their 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 worth and or their, their value. Maybe somebody fooled around, found out, fell in love. I don't know. Somebody's letting them go, though. Yeah. They didn't, for, they didn't foresee this, maybe. Or they or these people won't don't want to let go of the, them, this emperor. I don't know. Take it as it applies. Um, they're una unable to move forward, right? Because there's no communication. There's bad news. Um... Something's coming back here. There's bad news, no communication. Something stopped suddenly. There were illusions here, okay? They want to get rid of their side pieces. That's what it is, right? This is defeat, okay? Somebody's very jealous and egotistical here. By hurting others, they hurt themselves. This is a defeat. Somebody's cut them out, Sp uh, sp spelling it out for them, right? They're, they're setting boundaries, cutting them out. This could be court. I don't know what this is. They're playing games. Game game playing is over. They're power plays. They's, they're all finger pointing and blaming one another, giving and receiving with each other here. This you could be wanting money here. Somebody's not fine here. They, they can't even pretend they're fine. Yeah. Wish fulfillment here. They want to heal. They want to balance something out with a soulmate, uh, with a twin flame. Their wish fulfillment was stability. They were reckless, careless, and foolish here. They were naive. Yeah, it was their ego that got, got in the way here. Parted ways with a, a twin flame, I think. Could be you, right? A soulmate. Um, this is a, a, a contract. This was a contract. Okay? Higher level contract here. And they didn't put in. They, they missed an opportunity because of their lies. They stole money. They lied. They're now they're stuck in their lies, I think. They're scared. There's no. Uh, there was a lot of illusions and lies. There could be magic here. They disrespected you. Okay, they lied about you. Okay, you healed your heart, and now somebody's coming in with a cup of love for you, and they feel defeated, right? They can't even fucking stop this from happening. They feel defeated because you're moving on, and they know you are. Okay, they want to block you. You can't. They don't want you moving on because they see your value and worth. They want to seize an opportunity, but if they come near you, they might be getting arrested here. 
or they know you know. They're a poor investment. You're not going to reinvest in them at all. Okay, it's time to move on. You've blocked them, and all they can do is cry at night, worried about you. Yeah. Yeah, no reconciling here, okay? This was unrequited love. You don't trust them. You're not going back to the past, okay? So all they could do, yeah, you're innocent. You're innocent, and what they did to you is horrible, okay? They could have really put you through some mental anguish here. You saw through the illusions. It was scandalous, okay? You broke free. Could be a coven. There were third-party situations. They uh, spread egregious gossip about you while they were drinking. Yeah, third-party situations here, okay? Now they're watching you work. You're a high priestess. Be working online and they're watching you. They see how balanced you are. You're in alignment. Now they're crying. They're crying. They should have kept you. They should have kept hold held on to you instead of being a part uh, um, uh, a player. Instead of uh, you know having an, all that arrogance, right? They gave you nothing. They had nothing of value to give you, but more lies. You walked away. And it's a tower moment now because yeah, you're good news. Everybody loves you. You're happy. They 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 wound up with a whore. Yeah. And addictions. Not fair. They think it's not fair. Oh, well, there's clarity here. This is justice. They're out in the cold. Wow. Congratulations. I'm sorry I kind of went through that quickly, but that's just the way it is today. Uh, the Swan Queen. Okay. Transformation. They thought you were an ugly duckling, maybe. You, you grew into a beautiful swan. You have great intuition and patience. Okay. So patience does where um, is a virtue. It does pay off, okay? They wanted atonement here. They stabbed you so many times in the back. Oh, yes. Now you're coming into ab abundance, okay? Keep a positive mindset. Manifest exactly what you want. Gratitude and bliss. So 1331, okay? That, look it up. It might, have, might be something there for your message, right? Spirit guides, guardian angels, ancestors of white light. How are we going to end this read for today, please? It's a beautiful read. Congratulations. You're moving on to happiness. This person's getting exactly what they want, uh, what they asked for. Message in the bottle. No more messages. They can't get a hold of you. 15 in reverse. That's the devil in reverse. You saw through the illusions and broke free. Adds to a six in reverse as well. That's uh, in tarot. That's the lovers in reverse. They lost um, a twin flame and or past life soulmate. Something, somebody very, very um, a spiritual connection, okay? Poor decisions, okay? There's consequences to this. It was all one-sided. It was all them, 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 right? But it's a death. You're no longer struggling with this. The struggle is all theirs now. It's a permanent ending. It's a profound ending, okay? Message in the bottle. They cannot get a message to you. I think they're freaking out. You block them in every... Uh, I think spirit's blocking them, okay? They, they have no access to you any longer, Protection message. Are you refusing to acknowledge the signs because you want things as you want them? Red flags are not pretty decorations for you to admire. They're warning you for a reason. If something doesn't sit right with you, trouble could be hiding in the bushes. Don't ignore the signs. Spirit always has your best interests at heart and will draw your attention to what you are overlooking. So chances are they want to get a hold of you. They might, I mean, this person's a king of swords in reverse, okay? They could be potentially dangerous. They're a lying sack of shit. They're self-serving, self-absorbed. So maybe they're going to try something uh, to get to you. Uh, Spirit will give you a, a nudge, okay? So far, they've blocked the majority of their messages, I think. I think maybe this is a test, one final test to, before you let go of this. Um, see if you're going to fall back into... Mm, I don't think you will. I think you, you're done. You're done. You, you're well aware, okay? This is the end of the road, Seven of Pentacles. Okay, this is just, the minute you totally let go when it's finally over, that's when their justice or their judgment is going to be enacted. That's when karma starts. Okay, so I think you're at the end of this. Okay, so it's up to you what you choose to do, but I think mm, they're going to give you a big sign. Somebody's here, they could be showing up at your work. I don't know, could be trying to talk to you at work, but just ignore it. Call the police if you need to, um, ask for, for help. Get rid of them. Get a uh, straining order. Do what you need to do. Okay. Once you ena enable that, once you've made it clear you don't want anything to do with this person any longer, that's when their karma starts. Okay. It's going to hit hard too. I hope this helps. Please like, share, and subscribe. And until next time, take care.